Uh, we can't overlook that. You know, um, it's obvious what the direction our team's trying to go in, but um, it's also very obvious that's a team that knows us well, you know them well, and they always do play as close. So uh, regardless of what the records may indicate, it's going to be a battle. And uh, we have to respect them as an opponent when they come in. But uh, we're trying to stack um, good football together. So um, last week against the Ravens was, was a good start of the direction we want to go in this postseason. But we can't get to our postseason without going through the Bills first. So we have to play solid football uh, back-to-back weeks, and that's what, we're tra- well, that's what we're striving to do. I think that um, our team has to be ca- confident in the plays that we're calling. And, um, you know, when we have an offense that's hitting on the ground, and we're passing the ball well through the air. You have a defense that's playing strong. I think the best game they played all year. You have special teams who are contributing. You know, your team is playing how you want them to play. So for us, I mean, I think it's just not being one dimensional. I think it's whenever, you know, we have the chance to go in there and run the football or we know that the defense struggles with the run, we have to go in there and be strong at the run. If they're weaker, if they're weak at the pass, then we have to be able to attack them, you know, through the air. And, uh, you know, for us as a team, you know, I try not to focus as an individual, but uh, for us as a team, it was big to close out the game the way that we closed that game out and also being in Baltimore. That's a tough place to play. That's a good football team. And uh, for us, that was a big challenge. And I think that we stepped up to the challenge and we did what we had to do. But... All that, you know, to say, you know, none of that matters this week. We've got to go out there and we've got to handle the bills. How difficult was that having to be on the sideline a few, few weeks ago? Uh, you know, I, I just really believe this, that uh, God will never put you through anything more than you can handle. And uh, for me, um, it wasn't what I wanted, but I know why I got there. It wasn't like coaches woke up and decided to, hey, let's bench Stephen Ridley today. Um, I put myself there. But uh, for me, it's about not letting your past mistakes hold you down. And uh, I think that life brings you that. You're going to have adversity. You're going to have stuff that you're going to go through. But it's how you bounce back from it as a person. And um, I love what I do. I love the sport that I play in. You know, God put me in. So for me, I can't I can't sit on the path, whether it's success or whether it's, you know, something that I don't want, you know. But for me, it's focusing on these upcoming weeks. Because I think if we finish this year the way that we want to finish this year, nobody will really remember what happened in the past. But it's going to take a total team effort. And it's not just about me. It's about the running back room in general being strong, whoever the, whoever the number is back there. You know, whether it's Shane, whether it's Brandon, whether it's Blunt, whether it's me, whoever it is, we have to be accountable and we have to go out there and be a strong point for this team.